All right, it's Thursday, fourth best day of the week. I'll explain that one later. But we're making a smoothie today. We got frozen blackberries, snickerdoodles. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a party. So get into it. We're gonna start. I got about half cup of water, right there, and I'm gonna hit it with a cup and a half of almond milk. And I'm going to splash everywhere as I'm doing it. Oh, not too bad. We're going to go, we got our PE Science Select Protein. Amazing snickerdoodles flavor. This was a top notch protein. Sweet. I thought it would work well with the blackberries. We're going to give it a try. So we're going to go one scoop of that. 110 calories and 24 grams of protein protein to build the muscles and um, I'm going to give that a zip. Zippity pippity, zippity pippity, zippity pippity on the Blendtec. Just like to get it kind of frothy it seems to make a smoother smoothie that way one and three quarter cups of blackberries I was actually amazed that this is only a hundred calories so good job blackberries you may not be the best tasting fruit but you don't have a lot of calories two yogurt cubes yep a little bit of ice just for good show always put ice in let's give that a zip Yes. super thick here and I actually have a little bit of room on calories so I'm going to go with a little bit of almond milk. I want to keep it under 300 so give us, this will give us about one and three quarter cups of almond milk, a little bit less than that but I just want a little, it's just a little thick, it's almost like ice cream right now. Much better. So, now is the time we taste it. And I'm going to predict that it's going to be good, but only one way to find out. Nice. Well, let me change the angle for just a sec. I'll show you the pour. Okay, there's the pour. Nice, thick smoothie. Nice and thick. Look at that. I'll use a spoon just to keep it clean. And then, change the angle once again for the taste. Very good. Blackberries are tart. The snickerdoodle protein is super sweet. And pretty good combo. You get a lot of seeds. But overall, taste is really good. I'm going to give this one a solid 8 out of 10. 